These are Bloomberg terminals. Now you surprise me. Amazing, because they're quite expensive to keep. Incredibly. We need, it's the simulation, isn't it? Stations you have, was it? 6, 12. 12. I'm not even more. 14. Trading, Bloomberg, stocks, bonds, shares. All these might sound unfamiliar to most people, but not to practicing financiers or those aspiring to be. Students at Guildhouse School, a prestigious British school in London, previously known as Cats College London until October 2022, have a unique opportunity to take a trading course using Bloomberg terminals, something no other private school in England offers. Curious to know more? Of course. Let's break down what Bloomberg is and how it helps students at Guildhouse School. Let's dive in. These are Bloomberg terminals. Now you surprise me. Okay. Can I just say that uh, we work with universities as well, and uh, I've been to many. And universities which have Bloomberg Suites, they're really proud of it. Oh, yeah. I don't think I've met any colleges, and yes. I've been to hundreds. Yeah. I mean, secondary education colleges. Amazing, because they're quite expensive to keep. Incredibly expensive. Uh, you pay like an uh, annual or monthly we fee? An, uh, we pay an annual license. Annual license. We have, Amazing. we have students who want to study business or financial programs. We have a financial trading course. Even that. So stu and all students, if they want to, can get, do the Bloomberg Market Concepts course. Additions into their IGCSC or oh, A-level. So it's an additional course that they can do. Uh, we've got a lot of students here doing University Foundation Financial Trading because they want to go to one of the London universities to study finance. Is it just London universities you Generally, most, most of our students who come to Cats London want to stay in London. I see. Not okay. everybody, but most want to stay at one of the London universities. Yeah, of course, of course, of course. During a comprehensive tour of the Guildhouse School campus, Adil had the chance to meet and chat with students studying to become future economists, engineers, and psychologists. We'll leave the link to that tour in the description below this video. As for Bloomberg, it is an agency capable of analyzing the economic situation of almost every country in the world. Based on its findings, it compiles statistics, creates rankings, provides financial forecasts, and offers information on both global economies and individual companies. In addition to these services, Bloomberg runs its own television channel, Bloomberg TV, which is also dedicated to economics and finance. But yes, they get to know how to use the Bloomberg Labs, analyze all the data. These are the same things that the city traders use. I'm, I'm exactly amazing. the same. The only difference is the data that we get is delayed 20 minutes. Oh, I see. They're not live. If the the license will be about 20 times more expensive. Yeah. For live data. <laughs> for live, well, you don't need that. I we mean, don't need just, it. We need. It's the simulation, isn't it? Yeah, we need to teach. It's the real data. It's the same but it's slightly delayed. So you can't really use them as live trading terminals, okay? Yeah. But all the information is the same. Oh, interesting. So, so for future e economists and financiers, yeah. If they want to analyze company data, forecasts, everything's there, all the Bloomberg data. It's how, amazing. How cool. And how many stations you have? Was it 12, 6, 12? Oh, not even more. 14, 14 stations. 14 stations, amazing. Which is a lot more than some universities. <laughs> true, true. I went to University of Portsmouth. I did finance there. Yeah. Obviously, when I did it, they didn't have it. Yeah. But nowadays they do. I can't remember, but I think it's less than 14. Yes. We've got, compared to a lot of universities, we've got more terminals here. Why is that? Um, because we can. We're a partner with Bloomberg. Ah, I see. Uh, okay. You know, we're a, and you decided to focus on that segment. Yeah. It's, it's a really good resource and it's really heavily used and other schools do come to us and want to use it. Even that? Okay. Yes. All right. And universities. Even that? Yes. Okay. Do you know how much a school Bloomberg Business Lab costs? Here are your options. £50,000, £100,000 or £200,000. Take a moment to think about it. I'll share the correct answer a bit later, so stay tuned until the end of the video. Now, when it comes to using the service, it's worth noting that every student at Guildhouse School has access to the Bloomberg Market Concepts program. This introductory course covers the basics of financial markets and how to navigate them, 
And if you're wondering how to get into such an impressive school with opportunities like these, the answer is simple. With the help of our team at Mariati, for nearly 20 years, we've been guiding our clients in choosing and applying to top educational institutions around the world. We'd be more than happy to assist you as well. So it's a, it's a unique, it's something that's very unique. About half of our students uh -huh. study typically maths, business, economics courses. All oh, right, so business related. Business related is a big part of what we do here. Uh -huh. And we've got our own um, Cats London Business School. Mm -hmm. where we offer a variety of different programs, have speakers, have university visits. Because your branches in Cambridge, they specialize more in science, I would say, right? Yeah, mm -hmm. more, more sciences here. Most of, I said, half of our students here are business related, Yeah, uh, but that's the market, that's yeah. what they want. Mm -hmm. And London being one of the major financial trading centers in the world, it makes sense. Of course. So the city of London being 10 minutes away, mm -hmm. you know, 20 yeah. minute walk. You want to walk? Great right stuff. It's not far. Okay. Here's an interesting fact. The design of this lab was inspired by the European headquarters of Bloomberg, which was recognized in October 2018 as the best new building in the UK. Now let's go back to our question about the cost of such a lab and test your intuition. What was your initial answer? 50,000 pounds, 100,000 pounds? The answer is higher, 200,000 pounds. Let us know in the comments if you guessed correctly. If you enjoyed this video, give it a like and subscribe to the channel so you don't miss out on more fascinating insights into the world of international education. That's all for now. Stay in touch and we'll see you in the next video.